Storage Grid 11.8 introduces ILM policy tags, allowing tenants to granularly apply ILM policies to individual buckets. In this demo, I'll be creating policy tags for bronze and silver service tiers on an 11.8 grid. On this grid, our bronze policy is the default, but as an additional tier, let's create a silver ILM policy. Our silver policy will store one copy on each site by default and store objects larger than 200 kilobytes on both sites with erasure coding 2 plus 1. This allows buckets assigned the silver ILM policy tag to maintain data availability in the event of a site outage. Now we can create our silver policy tag. Go to the ILM policy tags page, click create, and name our tag silver. Now, using the dropdown, we can apply the silver policy to the silver tag. This modal displays a list of policy tags that will be updated. Clicking Assign Policies will activate the ILM policies listed here. If you're changing pre-existing policy tags, the new ILM policy will be activated on buckets assigned those tags. If you're creating a new policy tag, tenant administrators will be able to assign the new tag to their buckets. Once we're sure, type yes in the box and click Assign Policies. Now, tenants can choose between the default and silver ILM policy tags on a bucket by bucket level. Now, looking at the Storage Grid Tenant Manager page, you can see I've created a bronze bucket and a silver bucket on my example tenant. If I go to the bronze bucket, you can see it has the default ILM policy tag assigned to it, which applies the bronze ILM policy. If I go to my silver bucket, we can assign it the silver tag which will cause the silver ILM policy to be applied to objects in the silver bucket. ILM policy tags allow grid administrators to offer tenants multiple quality of service options. Depending on your storage needs, you might create many ILM policy tags or simply utilize the single default tag. Thank you for watching.